Two up, two down. Mike Trout tripled off a fastball earlier. That's certainly encouraging, but has also done well, very well, off non fastballs to this point. In, in, a, in a sport right now where you're seeing pitchers throw a lot more non fastballs, that's pretty impressive to be able to put up those numbers. An OPS of 1755. Homered off of a cutter in the game yesterday. There's a cutter of sorts for Eflin, a softer one than what Trout saw yesterday. Trout with the triple tonight, tying Sean Figgins for the second most in Angels history for a career. He also already has the same number of triples and stolen bases that he had all of last season. Playing he is running really well. And he's in tremendous shape. So far in the first 10 games of the year, he has a triple, four homers, and two steals. And you, you might be surprised to hear that that's not something that happens very often. That's only the sixth time since the year 2000 that a player has put that together. Brian Reynolds did it last year. Acuna did it a couple of years ago. It's rare for a player to rack up four homers, two steals, and a triple in the first 10 games of the season. And Trout right now is lowest chase percentage of his career and hard hit percentage. I know it's it's still only nine games into the season, but there's been a lot of positives for Trout. There's a long fly ball straight away center field. Here he goes all the way back. He waves goodbye. Mike Trout has home run number five. And that conversation for a four seam fastball. Well, that baseball was crushed. Triple home run already for Trout. 108.7 off the bat. Yeah. He's rocking and rolling. 423 distance wise. That's another one of those eclipse moon shots. Exactly. <laughs> Mike Trout cranking a homer to straightaway center field. He just seems more comfortable. He just feels it. That's a four seam fastball. You see the reaction by Eflin. 92 mile an hour four seamer right dead center field for Trout. And he knew it off the bat. And that dugout loving it. Chase Hill said that we're not worthy. We're not worthy. He's one behind Rocky Calavito on the all time home run list and three away from Hall of Famer Carlton Fisk.